President Obama has refused to look at the situation in Iran and Egypt and around the world and do what Ronald Reagan was never afraid to do, was to call evil, evil. Was to identify... <laughs> was to identify the enemy, to identify who the Muslim Brotherhood is, who the Iranian mullahs are and what they're all about. And no, it's not just the ter terrorist, although he doesn't even use the word terrorist, but they have an ideology, a theology, that wants to destroy Western civilization and the head of Western civilization, the United States of America. He doesn't say that jihadism is evil. He doesn't say that Sharia law is incompatible with Western civilization and the United States, which they are. An example of that is, if you look at the 9-11 Commission report, there were over 600 times where the word Islam, Muslim, Jihadist, and Al-Qaeda were mentioned. In the last year's after-action review from the Fort Hood shooting, where the shooter, a Jihadist, was yelling, Allah al-Akbar, the word Islam, Muslim, Jihadist, Al-Qaeda, none of those words were ever mentioned in that report. This is not leadership. This is not moral authority. This is someone who doesn't believe in truth and evil in America.